the class let us continue to discuss the uh, this particular course about the applied economics so we are now in lesson 7 and now we will discuss about the service industry so our expectation for this particular topic after going through this lesson you are expected to first define service business next understand the importance of the service industry on the economy and then the third one apply business principles tools and techniques in the service business before we will jump into our lesson we will have a pre-test first so number one a business that provides professional support to its clients so this kind of business that will provide professional support to its clients a merchandise b manufacturing c retail trade or d service trade it is a business that provides professional support to its clients the answer for number one is letter d service trade number two below are the examples of service except a education b auditing c laundry or d none of the above so the answer for number two is none of the above it means that these three are examples of a service number three these services support the daily operation and activities of any business okay it's part uh, this kind of service that will support the daily operations and activities of a business a business services b personal services c social services or d none of the above the answer for number three is a business services number four these services are not a profiting motive but is a social cost it is not a profiting it means that it is a non-profit a business services b personal services c social services or letter d none of the above the answer for number four is letter c social services and last number number five these services are engaged in commercial activities that provide needs to individual they will provide the needs of individual a business services b personal services c social services or letter d none of the above so the answer for number five is letter a business services so congratulations for those who got the five points or perfect score so now let's proceed to the formal lesson we will discuss about the service business so a service business is a company that provides professional support to its clients so from a business standpoint service businesses are those that provide an activity or work with a commercial purpose so this kind of business offers tasks related to consulting accounting transportation cleaning hospitality traveling or maintenance among others so these businesses are now delivered not just physically but also through virtual platforms like web-based system or mobile application so this industry hires a bigger portion of the labor force as compared to manufacturing or trade businesses so there are three types of services we have business services personal services and social services so let's discuss first about the business services so the most basic definition would be business services support the daily operations okay so the business will support i mean the business services will support the daily operations and activity of any business so for example giving technical support and services to businesses uh, which nowadays is needed in the day-to-day -day operation so other business services are banking warehousing insurance telecommunication transport and etc again the business services will provide the daily operations 
of the business. Next is personal services. So these services are engaged in commercial activities which intended for individual needs. From the word personal, it will provide the individual needs. So the service is uniquely offered and intended for each customer. So some examples of personal services are catering, hotel and accommodation, medical, beauty clinic and spa, and any kind of artistic endeavor such as painting and sculpting, etc. And then lastly, is it is called social services. So these services are linked to public services. So from the word social, it will link into the public okay public services they provide by the government or the nonprofit organization not like with the personal and business services uh, a business a kind of business business that will provide to the particular business or for the personal needs but for social services the provider of such services is not coming from any businesses but rather it is coming from the government or a non-profit organization so the service is not a profit motive but for a social cause so social services mostly offer in the sectors of education sanitation medical facilities housing and etc so these are the three types of services again for the recap the first one is uh, business services that will provide a daily support to a business or business operations then number two is the personal services that will provide uh, uh, individual needs and then for number three which is the social services the provider of such services is coming from the government or a non-profit organization so now let's discuss about the service industry in the philippines so from an economic perspective service businesses are also known as tertiary industry or sectors so the latest annual survey of um, philippine business and industry or aspbi showed that a total of 6398 establishment in the formal sector of the economy were engaged in professional scientific and technical activities in 2017 so this represents a decrease of 6.2 so it decreases compared with the 7,048 establishments recorded in 2016. So among the industry groups, photographic activities recorded the highest number of establishment of 1,426 or 22.3% of total. So this was followed by the legal activities with 1,168 establishments. Moreover, it was reported that a total of 1,872 establishments with total employment of 20 and over in the formal sector of the economy were engaged in administrative and support service activities in 2017. So this is the same as the number of establishments reported in 2016. Okay, They have the same uh, number of establishments as reported in 2016. So among the industry, all uh, call centers and other related activities had the highest number of establishment of 580 followed by the private uh, security activities uh, with the 380 establishment. So temporary employment agencies activities ranked third with 300, uh, 308 establishment. So a total of 6,663 establishments in the formal sector of the economy were engaged in human health and social work activities in 2017. Again, they were engaged in human health and social work activities in 2017. So this reflects a decrease of 18.4%. Again, it decreases from the one, uh, 8,170 establishment reported in 2016 so among the industry groups medical and dental practice activities led the sector with 4,774 establishment or 71.6% um, of the total so this was followed by the hospital activities 
with 1,112 um, establishment and other social work activities without accommodation with 421 establishment. So for the reflection of this particular topic, according to Fred Rogers, life is for service. I hope that you have learned something from this short online lecture. And don't forget to answer the quiz via Google Form. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.